Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to roll back a Jenkins installation by, by using JUM. Okay, but first, if you haven't visited the channel before, I invite you to take a look at the playlist where you will find a lot of free tutorials for technologies and tools like Terraform, Ansible, AWS, SonarCube, Jenkins, Docker and more. Okay, here I'm in the main dashboard of Jenkins as you can see and I'm going to take a look at the version which is the LTS1 346 we can confirm that here in the Jenkins download page this is the LTS1 but what happened if for some reason this version is not compatible with all of your plugins or is causing some issues after the upgrade well you can roll back to your previous installation by using JUM how can we do that? by using the Joom history command. Joom uh, history will offer um, a history for all your transactions whether you can install, remove or upgrade any package Joom will, uh, will save these, these changes in this history. So let me take a look on the details of the transaction uh, 81. So I'm going to use info and then the number and here it says when it was uh, upgraded or what uh, what happened to w when we run this uh, this jump command and also what packages were modified and all the instances that uh, was installed or updated as well you can see the previous version was the 332 and it was upgraded to the LTS one so how can we roll back by using this? I'm going to use as, as well a Joom history with the option undo and the transaction ID. So I'm going to remove this transaction and it will install the previous version. Okay, it's just finished and as you can see the new version that is installed in my system is the previous one. One of the advantage of having Joom is that uh, it will track all of the, the dependencies for the installation without manual intervention intervention okay uh, also it will stop the service make the upgrade or the rollback and then start the service by itself that's another advantage so i'm in the login screen i'm going to log in to confirm the version and here as you can see i have already rolled back to the previous one which in my case was working on the 332 and this is how you can roll back to a previous installation by using Jump. I hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe to the channel and let me know your comments thanks